Want to automatically post new RSS feed items to Twitter using N8N? In this video, I'll show you how to keep your followers updated, no code required. Open the website you want to post from. This could be your blog, a news site, or any page that updates regularly. Copy the link, go to rss.app, and paste it into the generator. RSS app will instantly create a ready-to-use RSS feed from almost any web page. You can also paste in your own existing RSS feed and choose whether you want the feed just the way it is or use the enhanced version with images. Then click Save to My Feeds. From here, you can apply filters to hide duplicates, include or exclude posts by keyword, or limit the amount of posts. Once you're satisfied, copy the generated feed URL. We'll use it in N8N. Now, open your N8N dashboard and click Create Workflow. First, add an RSS feed trigger node. This is what checks your RSS feed for new updates. Set how often you want to check for new items. Then paste in the RSS app feed URL you copied earlier. Click Fetch Test Event to make sure it's pulling in the latest posts correctly. Next, click the plus button and search for Twitter. Choose the Create Tweet operation. When you first add the Twitter node, you'll need to connect your X account. To do that, go to the X Developer Portal and log in with your regular X account. This is the platform where developers connect external tools, like N8N, to post tweets automatically. In your project, go to the App Settings and open User Authentication Settings. Set the app permissions to Read and Write and Direct Message, and choose Web App, Automated App, or Bot as the app type. In the App Info section, you'll need to enter two URLs. For Callback or Redirect URL, use the link provided in N8N. And for Website URL, you can use the N8N one. Click Save, then copy the Client ID and Client Secret. Now go back to N8N and paste in the Client ID and Client Secret from the X Developer Portal. Then, authorize your account. In the Text field, you can customize your tweet by adding text or mapping the fields from the RSS feed. Click Execute Step to test it. If you see your post appear on your X account, it's working perfectly. Click Execute Workflow to test the full automation. And when everything looks good, toggle the workflow to active. And that's it. You've set up an automated system that turns your RSS feed into tweets. Try it today at RSS App.